Hey guys, this is Malinki. Welcome back to my channel, Voice of Malinki. Today we will talk about the shell calling in snail. And if you are new in my channel, please subscribe my channel. And if you like my video, please do like, comment, and share my video. Uh, shell calling in snail is an example of maternal effect. There are two strains of water snails that differ in the direction of shell coiling. Shell coils right is called dextral. It is a dominant trait. That means the genotype should be capital D capital D or capital D small d. Shell coils left is called sinistral. It is a recessive trait. That means the genotype should be small d, small d. Now, coiling of snails is not determined by individual's own genes. It is determined by the genotype of the mother, regardless of its phenotype. This is the most important concept in this topic. Mother's genotype decides baby's phenotype but mother's phenotype doesn't play any role in baby's phenotype let's explain so here mother is dextral capital d capital d and father is sinistral small d small d if we cross them all the f1 progeny would be capital D, small d and dextral. Why they are dextral? Because their maternal genotype is capital D, capital D that is dextral. Now if we perform a self cross among these F1 individuals, four types of genotypes we will get in F2, right? But all will be dextral only. Why? Because their maternal genotype is capital D, small d, that is dextral. Okay, again, if you notice F3 generation, all progeny from this capital D, capital D would be dextral. All progeny from this capital D, small d would be dextral but all progeny from this small d small d would be sinistral because the maternal genotype is small d small d here hence all the babies are sinistral let's see the reciprocal cross here mother is sinistral that is small d small d and father is dextral that is capital D capital D. If we cross them all the progeny in F1 would be capital D small d and they are sinistral. Why they are sinistral? Because their maternal genotype is small d small d that is sinistral. Now if we perform a self cross among these F1 individuals four types of genotypes we will get in F2. But all will be dextral. Why? Because their maternal genotype is capital D small d that is dextral. Again if you notice the F3 generation all progeny from this capital D capital D would be dextral. All progeny from this capital D small d would be dextral. But all progeny from this small d small d would be sinistral. That means the offspring whose mothers are either homozygous or heterozygous for right coiling are right coilers. Even if they are homozygous for left coiling. In the same way the offspring whose mothers are homozygous for left coiling 
are left coilers. Even if they are homozygous or heterozygous for right coiling. So actually this is because the dextral allele capital D produces a cytoplasmic protein that causes right handed coiling and the offspring receives its cytoplasm only from its mother. So if you uh, wish to get the PDF notes of this topic, please check the description box or first pinned comment. I hope you liked the lecture. Thank you.